Obesity is a fat problem. Feeling overweight affects everyone, especially after eating a whole box of pizza. Trust me, I've been there before. Standing 5'4", 225 pounds, I was the butt of every joke. Due to diet restrictions, as well as exercise, I was able to lose the weight. However, those two strategies, they don't work for everybody. Obesity has affected me. And my passion to do my research is to ensure that it doesn't happen to any of you. My name is Julian Yabbit, and I study ways that our body breaks down fat with hopes in finding new therapies for obesity. I've been able to summarize obesity into one simple equation. Energy intake is greater than energy expenditure. Take a look at my two friends here, Holly and Annie. It's my favorite twins from one of my favorite movies, The Parent Trap. Who do you think here eats more? You are probably going to say Hallie because she's noticeably fatter and plumper. But this was a trick question because they both eat exactly the same amount. But why is this happening? Well, do you remember our equation on obesity? This must mean that Hallie has reductions in her energy expenditure. And this was due to the loss of these dark, small, circular regions called beige fat. White fat stores the breakfast you had this morning. Beige fat, it does the exact opposite and burns those calories. Imagine being able to burn calories on your belly without having to do absolutely anything. However, obesity, diabetes, as well as old age, all permanently reduce our beige fat. Therefore, the solution is clear. We must find ways to increase our beige fat to, pr to protect us from obesity. To do this, I currently study the neurotransmitter serotonin, mostly known for its roles in the brain. Serotonin can also be produced in our white blood cells. I have recently discovered that serotonin from our white blood cells reduces the amount of beige fat that we have. To show this, I genetically removed Annie's ability to create serotonin in her white blood cells. And as a result, she has increased beige fat. And now, Annie is loving her new look because she's slimmer, happier, and healthier. These findings, they laid the foundation for novel weight loss therapies so that you and I can look and feel like Annie too. My name is Julian Yabbit, and I'm one step closer to making the fat problem of obesity into a sliver. Thank you.